Hello, I'm Taylor Reifer from the 3QI Labs team, here to tell you about our Autest cross-platform automation framework. I will be walking you through the Autest web module for cross-browser testing where users can conduct comprehensive testing across all major browsers on Windows and Mac OS X platforms. You can check out the other videos on our website for the Autest M web and M app modules for automated iOS and Android mobile browser testing and mobile application testing. So let's get started by logging into Autest. You'll be directed to your dashboard, which gives you a quick snapshot and overview of your testing activities. Then we'll navigate to the test case section, where users build and manage their tests. The Autest web module supports numerous open source automation technologies, like our own automation DSL Autest Lib, then Cucumber, Selenium, Sekuli, Water, and Water WebDriver. We continue to add more supported technologies to the platform on a regular basis. Here is an example Cucumber test, Account Contact, where the user logs into the Salesforce app, adds an account, adds a contact, makes changes to the contact, and verifies and deletes the account and contact. Clicking on the test, you'll see the simple English Cucumber script. You can also script in other supported languages like Ruby and Java. Autest also supports inline editing directly in the browser so you can make quick edits to your tests, save, and re-execute without ever leaving the browser. I'm going to intentionally edit this script to inject an error into the test to demonstrate how Autest reports errors. I save the new script and now I can move on to starting the job. I go to the Jobs tab, click Add a new job, and this takes me to the Scheduled Jobs page. Here you select the test cases you want to execute. You can select any combination of categories test cases so you want to run on, and for now, we will run the accounts contact script that we just edited. Next, you'll select the environment you want to execute against, the specific OS browser version combination, and here we have Windows 7, Windows XP, and in this case, we will use the Mac OS X Firefox browser, version 25. Now, one of the big advantages of Autest is the ability to scale as your automation coverage volume increases, letting you manage hundreds of physical or virtual desktops running a multitude of OS browser combinations. For more scalability, Autest even supports multi-threading, allowing you to execute jobs in parallel and or sequentially, allowing you to significantly cut down your execution time. You can also schedule jobs to run at a predefined date, time, and frequency. For example, let's say we want to run this job every Friday, or we can run the job immediately. Autest can also send out email notifications if any errors occur as the job is being executed, or if you want to be notified at completion. We've scheduled the job to run immediately, so the job will start executing momentarily, and this job list gives you the status of the run, start times, end times, etc. You can see here the job is currently running, and now we will see our Firefox browser come up and begin to run the Salesforce test. Right now, it is logging in and is about to add a new contact. Once the job has finished running, we can see our reports on the report section. The report section lists out the summary reports for each job, gives you metadata around each run, the number of scripts, number of fails, platform details, etc. And you can click a specific job to drill down on the results for line by line level detail. And you can even see exact durations for each interaction, which give you a proxy for a performance of your application. It also gives you complete traceability into the tests. Clicking a line in the report gives you the corresponding line in the script, so you can quickly identify the root cause of a given fail, the steps to reproduce, and even make simple edits and reruns. Here you can see our fail that we set up, and what's cool about Autest is it takes screenshots at the point of failure to give you more insight and visibility into the root cause of the fail. We will just simply go back into the script, edit out that line, and save. There, Autest allowed me to fix the failure without ever leaving the browser. As part of reporting, you can conveniently export your report in PDF or Excel format and share with other Autest and non-Autest users. Finally, we have the Assets tab to support your data and keyword-driven frameworks. You can upload your own data sources, Excel, CSV, files, and custom libraries that can be called across multiple tests. So that was our quick introduction to the Autest web module for automated cross-browser testing. Thank you for your time, and you can always get more information at 3qilabs.com 
and be sure to check out our other videos on YouTube.